What's going on guys, this is Jonathan here with TLD bringing you an unboxing slash preview install overview of iLife 11. You guys can see the back of the box kind of really highlights what they're looking at. They kind of ignored iWeb I think, but I'll go over that in the review of iLife. Um, but the main focus is GarageBand, iPhoto, and iMovie. Now this comes in at 49 bucks. It's available today. You guys can head down to the Apple Store. That's where I picked mine up or you can order it online. So you guys can see nothing fancy as a disc. Go ahead and pop it in. I'll walk you guys through the install right now. Um, go ahead and click install iLife and it's going to prompt you to the next screen that you guys see right here. Welcome to the iLife installer. It's going to give you the blah 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 about iLife. Continue, next, install. It does take 4 gigs of space if you guys were curious about that, but it doesn't really matter because it's erasing the old one and putting this one in. Uh, and for those of you who are wondering if it erases your old photos or projects from GarageBand, it doesn't. It keeps those intact. Um, the estimated install time was about 26 minutes, but the real life time was 10 minutes. So here you guys can see uh, there's some old photos from the previous iPhoto. We're going to hop up to the corner and make sure it's the iPhoto 11. It is. Um, so let's go ahead and give a rundown of iLife. All right, so like I said, this is a little quick little overview of what's new in iLife 11. They really focused on three uh, applications, iMovie, iPhoto, and GarageBand. In iMovie, they introduced some new movie trailers, which basically allows you to take some clips uh, and put them in some prearranged sequences that makes them like you'd see them at the movies. Seems kind of fun, but almost like a novelty at the same time. I can see that wearing off after the first few tries. Now, they introduced some new audio editing, some effects, a people finder, which is similar to faces from iPhoto. Uh, and that was about it. You have some new sports themes and news themes. Nothing too exciting there to me in my opinion but you guys might dig that now moving on to iPhoto 11 there's some new full screen modes there's Facebook enhancements uh, there's some email features and of course new slideshows which is cool uh, that was probably one of the stronger points of the upgrade better than iMovie for sure uh, and they really focused on books which obviously they're gonna try to make some money off of it buy you buy the books from Apple they're gonna make a, a lot of money and then some letter press cards they kind of covered that in the press conference so like I said this is uh, just iPhoto 11 I'll give you guys an in-depth review of it coming out later this week uh, and lastly GarageBand 11 which was pretty cool to me they seemed like they brought a lot of the Logic Pro features over to GarageBand um, flex time which is basically almost like cheating uh, basically um, but if you didn't hold the note long enough or you took a beat or whatever you can extend it you can make it shorter for vocals um, it's called comping from like audio editing from Pro Tools or Logic Pro they're kind of bringing this over to GarageBand um, and then groove matching is the same thing maybe if you're off tempo with your drummer again it's kind of like cheating um, but it'll sync them up and and almost, uh, they call it quantizing from Logic Pro. They're bringing that to GarageBand. Then, of course, they're going to bring some new guitar amps. They have a new feature called How Did I Play, which basically allows you to play along with kind of a, a lesson or a tutorial, and it'll let you know how you did. Other than that, they'll include some new lessons, and that pretty much wraps it up for GarageBand uh, and the whole iLife suite. Like I said, I'm not going in-depth for everything on this. I just wanted to give you guys an overview, and you guys can see each tab right here will become a review once it's live. So go ahead and stay posted. I'm going to work on that all this week uh, and get those out to you. So GarageBand 11, iPhoto, iMovie, and then I'll review iLife as a whole. Uh, you guys can expect those four videos very soon. So hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys next time.